Let us now study the construction of a voltmeter by a galvanometer. It is also a similar process in which we have studied the construction of an ammeter by a galvanometer in which we connect a shunt resistance in parallel with a galvanometer. And here for a given galvanometer with the parameters, if say its parameters are known to us which are Ig and Rg, where Ig is the full deflection current and Rg is the coil resistance. And if we plan to construct a voltmeter of range Va, and Va is the maximum potential difference which it can measure. So, we already analyzed that uh, galvanometer can be converted into a voltmeter by connecting a high resistance in series with it. Let us see the effect of uh, connecting a high resistance in series with a galvanometer. Say in this galvanometer, across terminals A and B, we apply a potential difference uh, V. Now, in this situation, if we apply a potential difference V, a current flows through the galvanometer due to this potential difference V and the value of current we can write as V by Rg plus Rh. Now, we know well that uh, the galvanometer will be deflected by full only when a current Ig flows through it. So, if we wish to make it a voltmeter of range Va, then the very first thing we need to change the scale of this galvanometer from 0 to Va. And in this situation, if a current Ig passes through the same galvanometer, it will be deflected by full scale and it gives us a reflection that it is measuring the voltage Va, if it is looking like a voltmeter. So, Ig must pass when a voltage Va is applied across it, that is our aim. So, in this situation, Ig must be equals to Va by Rg plus Rh. If this high resistance is not there in series, then obviously due to low value of uh, coil resistance Rg, very high current flows, which will be very high compared to the full deflection current due to which the galvanometer will get damaged. So, in this situation, we connect a high resistance so that the current passing through the measuring device will reduce to the maximum limit of uh, Ig. So, that on applying a potential difference via current Ig flows and it gives uh, us an idea that uh, we can measure the full deflection when a potential difference Va is connected across it. So, this implies the value of high resistance here we can calculate. This will be Va by Ig minus Rg. So, for any given value of uh, galvanometer characteristics Ig and Rg, we can easily convert it into a voltmeter of desired range Va by connecting uh, the appropriate value of high resistance which can be calculated by using this expression. And a typical voltmeter you can see here in this picture. Here uh, the symbol V is written uh, in between the scale which gives an indication that uh, it is a voltmeter and you can see when a potential difference is applied across it, uh, the needle will deflect uh, by the same amount of which the potential difference is applied and this is the basic uh, device we call voltmeter. Actually, it is a galvanometer in which the scale is changed for uh, transforming it into a voltmeter along with a high resistance connected in series, which can be calculated by this expression.